So welcome to the panel discussion at the forum of the VDB and thanks also for your participation. Thanks for addressing some challenges uh, which are already identified by the European Commission as well as solutions um, by Siemens. I will talk about how we de redefine mobility at Stadler today and how we plan to redefine it for tomorrow. My name is Punar Bilge and I'm a project manager at Stadler Ray for train data intelligence. Um, let us start with uh, first with our ambition. So we are convinced that digitalization will tra um, transfer the rail transportation entirely. Therefore, we need to provide modern, comfortable and also environmentally friendly trains which can fulfill the needs of our customers as well as passengers and make traveling more pleasant. So here you see three um, motivations from our side. First, we see that the customer requirements has changed to more mobility and also to more intermodal travel needs. So it's not about uh, delivering good quality trains anymore in the rail business. It's more about mobility solutions that can manage the whole life cycle of transportation and rolling stock. So the second motivation is that we need to be more sustainable on the train and track and that means that we also need to utilize the rail network better that crosses regional borders. So for us, digitalization is the core value driver for passengers, for customers that are partly operators and also for us as manufacturers. It will transfer the understanding of connected assets and also information to get more information and uh, insights about timetables, accessibility and so on. And it also helps us to increase the quality and reliability of our products. So Stadler, as you may know, manufactures based on modular concepts and provides service-related activities at more than 70 locations around the world. To ensure our performance, we have established agile processes for high-quality and lean projects. In addition to our expertise in manufacturing, we have a strong profile in digitalization and our digital portfolio can be divided into two main areas. One is the operation and maintenance and the second one is the automated train control. Let me share some examples um, of our expertise, how we redefine mobility at Stadler. Let's start with the operation and maintenance activities and uh, let me introduce you one of our flagship products, battery electrical multiple units as we can see it on the uh, left hand side. This one is also exhibited with our product Flirt Aku here at Innotrans at the outdoor um, stations and um, in this product we use alternative dry technologies as a game changer to become more climate friendly. Stadler is the global market leader in this field with a record range of 224 kilometers running on battery power. And this is thanks to the great advantage of the hybrid system. So we can, um, whenever um, overhead lines are available, charge the batteries and provide electricity. And in sections without the electricity, we close this with battery power. So therefore, we can create a win-win solution. That means we cause with a battery electric multiple unit less pollution overcome the regional lack of overhead lines and we also do have an assistance system on the train for energy optimized driving and extended battery life. So in the middle we see our um, passenger information system which, is, which also plays an important role. Here we uh, provide our passengers uh, with real-time information and um, they can receive any updates about timetable changes, next stops and so on. Sensors collect data about the level of occupancy of a passenger car, for instance, and provide it to the passengers so they know exactly where to get in and out of the train and which door to use. So at Stadler, we can scale these tools tailor-made based on the needs of our customers. And in addition to that, we also work 
on topics concerning the whole life cycle. For example, we develop condition-based uh, maintenance tools to prevent disruptions and breakdowns. Here on the right hand side you see the example of a digital twin where uh, Stadl and Deutsche Bahn have created the first virtual image of a complete train um, and to demonstrate how digitalization can also play a key role in transportation. The twin is based on the physical behaviors of um, the train, based on mechanics and electronic, uh, electrics, and the virtual image can focus on different components, such as air conditioning, wheel sets, and doors. And the data sent um, by these components can be processed with artificial intelligence, so we can increasingly make a perfect simulation of the real train and use this information for operation and maintenance. That means that we send the trains to the maintenance whenever it becomes necessary. So the twin helps us to make rail transportation more reliable, more attractive and reduce life cycle costs. Let me also share with you some examples on um, our automated train control systems. Here we have established recently the business unit signaling and have acquired two high profile companies. This underscores also our ambitions in the future in this area. Um, for the sample of the European train control systems on the left hand side, we have developed a protection system with one of our uh, joint ventures. The system is called Guardia and consists of an hardware and software solutions installed on the train. We use this also for retrofitting um, existing fleets. So the position and speed of the uh, train can be displayed directly to the train driver and transmitted to the control center. In the middle we see the example of com uh, communication-based train control systems which we work on to uh, determine the train's position more accurately to compared to the same traditional signaling systems and this helps us to improve the traffic management and infrastructure control. We went even a step further and have taken passengers on board to experience uh, them in an automatically operated train. And for this to happen, um, we will work on the next generation of uh, for, uh, trains which can accelerate and brake automatically. And in this field, anti-collision is essential to um, contribute to a higher degree of safety, of course, and to make it possible by the metro lines as well as by um, on, on track in, in the city. So all of these examples testify the increase of reliability and the higher um, frequency of train operations. In Germany, it is called Deutschlandtakt to um, enable the nationwide integrated regular interval timetable and um, at Stadler we already have all of the necessary technologies to do so. So that was a smart and a brief view of our samples, how we redefine mobility at Stadler. And thank you for your attention. <laughs>